All right, let's, um, I think we got it going now. All right, let's get started. So really quick, I'm going to teach you on attraction marketing. You say you're familiar with attraction marketing, right? And you know how it works and stuff like that. So I'm going to teach you how you can actually use attraction marketing and how to implement it in, in your business. Um, and uh, really quick, uh, you know, attraction marketing, like you said, it's, it's what people, they, they know what it is, but they don't know how to use it. You know what I mean? They know, like, I've heard of attraction marketing. Yeah, that, you know, that attraction marketing thing, it works. But, you know, a lot of people just, they just don't know how to use it. So, and this is uh, not just what exactly what it is, but it's how to use it and how you can implement it in, you know, any business. You know, whether in your network marketing, uh, you know, insurance, real estate, you know, because a lot of people aren't using this. So, really quick, um, you know, 10-year professional basketball career. Um you know, I, I consider myself a network marketer. Um, I do affiliate marketing too, uh, online marketing, you know, internet marketing, but on the core network marketer. Uh, I actually got introduced to network market or attraction marketing, I should say, in 2012. Um, because, but before that, you know, I, I, I didn't know anything about attraction marketing at all. I didn't know, you know, what it was, how to use it, you know, why to use it, anything like that. So, but I got introduced back in 2012. And, you know, I'm just a uh, all-around good guy. Well, I think I am. So, yeah. <laughs> so real quick, what you're going to learn, you know, what is attraction marketing, uh, common places where people actually struggle, um, you know, where your primary company fits in, and how to uh, profit uh, from the people who say no to your biz up. And this is really, really key um, because this is why a lot of uh, network marketers don't last in the game that long because they don't have a way to profit from the people who say no to their business opportunity and that's what um, you know this is a tool if you're using attraction marketing this is a tool that you can actually use to uh, keep you in the game longer so what is attraction marketing uh, attraction marketing is the art of doing things a certain way to attract people that do not know you but they want to connect with you learn from you and possibly work with you so what does all that mean? It's just basically it's simply putting more value into the marketplace. You know, if you put value into the marketplace, just like Jim Rohn said, the more the more value you put into a marketplace, your bank account will benefit from it. You know, it's not the exact quote, but he says something similar to that. So once you put value into the marketplace and in whatever industry that you're in, you will attract more people to you. And it's, it, this is very very rarely taught by you know, network marketing, you know, coaches or teachers, you know, going to, you know, hundreds of uh, network marketing events, um, what they teach is, um, you know, product, they, they teach you product uh, training, you know, like how, how this product works, how to use it and all that stuff. And that's not attractive. Now, I'm not saying that's not good information and you shouldn't learn that stuff, but that's not really attracting people to, to, to them, you know, you know what I mean? So, if you want to actually, you know, start, you know, recruit more people and attract more people to you to ask what it is that you're doing, you have to put value into the marketplace. So, where do people struggle? Well, obviously, there is a, a, a high failure rate in network marketing, and the failure rate's like 97 percent. You know, it's you know, it's unbelievable. It's you know, you know, three months, you know, after they've recruited, they're not making their you know tens of thousands of dollars, and they're gone. And <laughs> you know, tens of thousand dollars a month, I should say, and they're gone. And the reason why that is is because they're not using attraction marketing. You know, that when people are recruited into a network marketing business, it's usually you know maybe a family, a friend. Um, but if you are using online strategies, the reason why people are you know signing people up on autopilot is because they are using attraction marketing. They've used uh, attraction marketing online and offline, both both strategies to actually draw people to them because of the value they put into the marketplace and then keep them in there longer. But, you know, the reason why there's just such a high failure because there is no no attraction marketing with new network marketers. They don't know what that is. They don't know how to use it. Uh, they just don't implement it. And, you know, another reason why people struggle is, you know, they have no more people to talk to about the network marketing business. You know, they go to the family and friends, like, hey, I just joined this thing. We're going to make millions and millions of dollars. Um, and they're like, oh, that's one of those pyramid schemes. That's one of those scams. And they're gone. 
and they go back to the person who sponsored them and they're like, you know, hey, you know, I ran out of people to talk to. And they're like, well, just go talk to them again, you know. And they basically, uh, you know, beat them over the head with the opportunity until they buy something or they die. You know, where they block you off Facebook um, or, you know, they delete you, you know, delete your email, stop, you know, hitting me, you know, stop sending me all that crap. And what I said earlier, you know, the lack of money, you know, to keep them in the business. You know, a lot of, and going back to the attraction market, a lot of people, they don't teach uh, attraction marketing, but what they teach is, you know, your upline be like, hey, you know, they'll pick up the phone, hey, you know, if you upgrade this month, you can, you know, get, you know, get this product and, you know, you'll be able to hit your, you know, you'll be able to hit your numbers or, hey, you know, you know, once you order some more product and then I'll help you sell it. And then all of a sudden they got a garage full of, you know, these vitamins and juices and everything. And all of a sudden, you know, they're like, they can't sell it. They just got a, a garage full of product that they can't sell. And, you know, just lack of money. You know, they, you know they're like, I, I'm, I'm tired of putting money into this business. I can't, I can't sell, you know, my, my, my grapey grape juice or, <laughs> you know, my, uh, you know, my vitamin or whatever. So, you know, when, when, when they get tired of putting money into their network marketing business or, you know, buying products, then they just, you know, they don't have any money and they're, and they're gone. They're, you've lost them. So how exactly, where does your company, uh, what about your company? How does exactly does it feel, fit in? So there, there are two ways you can actually build your business. There's active prospecting and passive marketing. Active prospecting is going to be your highest return on investment. That's just fact. You know, you can prospect every single day and that'd be the highest return on your invest, investment. What most people do, though, is they do passive marketing. This is like 95% of the people who are online, they, they do passive marketing. And passive marketing is basically when an unnamed individual reaches out to you about you know, something that you're selling. Um, the reason why people are doing passive marketing is because they try to get away from active prospecting. You know, I know that you know, hurts a lot of people's feelings, but it's, it's true. You know, what they'll do is, they'll, on their Facebook page or whatever, you know, 20% discount on, uh, you know, this product this month, you know, if you get it through my link or, you know, get it here, it's $35 instead of, you know, you know, $50 or something like that. And they just, they, they basically use their Facebook page as a commercial, you know, and that's not attractive marketing, that's not attraction marketing at all. That's basically, you're just selling, you're just hoping somebody's going to opt in and buy your stuff and it, it's like throwing the Hail Mary, you know, it's like 99% of the time. It's, it's, it's not going to work. So what should you be doing? So you should be prospecting every single day. If you're part-time, two to five people. And if you're full-time, this is uh, five to ten people. And this should be, you know, offline or online. You know, Facebook is, you know, obviously a great place to do it online. Offline, this is great for, you know, networking events or even the cold market. You know, a lot of people don't want to talk to strangers. You know, I got to train in on that. But people don't want to talk to strangers, you know. You can use attraction marketing with cold, mar cold market prospecting. You can do use attraction marketing with uh, cold, mar cold market uh, prospecting on online with Facebook. There's a way to do it. You just know nobody's being taught properly how to do it because they've been focused more on, you know, product training instead of actually, you know, recruiting training, people, people skills. And create a piece of content uh, every day, you know, each day. You know, you should be creating a piece of content, um, and this can be, you know, a video, a blog, an article, a Facebook status update, and um, the the piece of content can be, it has to be valuable, meaning, you know, it has to be, you know, you, say you go to an event, you learn something in the event, you put that on your Facebook uh, status update, that's value that you're putting out there. You're going to start attracting people to you if you do that, instead of saying like, hey, I just came to the event, and you get... 30% off of, you know, if you become a new uh, sponsor, that's, you know, that's not attractive. But you're like, hey, I was at this event and, you know, I learned this, this, and this. You know, if you want to learn more, you know, give me a contact, you know, contact me, email me, and, you know, you can learn more information about that. That's, that's more attractive than just, you know, pitching on your uh, social media platform. So, how to make money from your nose. And this is where a lot of network marketers struggle because they don't understand this concept of actually how you can make money from or I should say a lot, but a lot of the network marketers that I speak with, they, they don't understand attraction marketing and they don't understand how you can actually make money from your nose. So this is just, you know, this is a fact. Um, 
look it up, whatever. I already told you about the high uh, failure rate. But 90% of the people are going to say no to your business opportunity. You ask them, hey, you want to join a business, 90% of them are going to say no. That's just, that's just how it is. But, you know, think about this for a second. Why not be able to profit from that percentage to say no? Because most of the people that 90% that say no, if you talk to another network marketer and they are so fired up about their business, like, yeah, you know, I got in this business, I'm going to kill it, you know, I'm going to make all this money, um, they go all in. Then all of a sudden, then, you know, why not be able to profit that percentage? You know, if somebody says no to your business opportunity or your product and you're in another network marketing company, then y'all just go separate ways and, you know, no money is exchanged. So not why not have a way to profit from that percentage? So what I do is, you know, um, yeah, what I said, yeah, I already said that. Most, you know, have their MLM company and, they, you know, and believe that it was that's the only way to help people. You know, most, most they have their MLM company. They believe that's the only way to help people, you know, and that's why a lot of people get in the network marketing industry because, you know, they say they want to help people and, um, you know, they want to, you know, help them build the life of their dreams. But if it's only their MLM company and they're in another MLM company and they believe that that one's going to help other people and not that other one, then there is, you're not going to, you know, change their mind. You know what I mean? You know, they, they, they you know, say, you no, know, this is my, which is fine. You know, if they're fired up that network marketing company which is fine, but it's, it's fine. But going back to that second one, why not profit from, from that percentage? You know, what I've done and what I suggest is, you know, I ask this question all the time. How are you doing with generating leads online for your business? That question right there, 98% of the people, they don't know how to generate leads online. You know, they, they, they just don't, you know, because they are doing what I suggested earlier. They're, you know, posting, you know, testimonials of their network marketing company. Why am I saying that, which is bad, but that's all they're doing. That's not attraction marketing. You know, testimonials are powerful, but if that's all you're posting of your network marketing company, people are not going to be attracted to that. They want to be attracted to the value. They're, they're attracted to value. People have agreed, Gene, that if you provide value to them, they will start, you know, reaching out to you and asking, you know, what your company is. But that one question right there, how you doing with generating leads for your business, 90 98, 99 percent of the people out there aren't generating any leads because they just don't know how. They don't know how to generate leads. You know, they're like, uh, you know, people I talk to is like, oh, well, you know, I get a lead or here, you know, I get one, two leads here, but it's still the same thing. Yeah, <laughs> you know, yeah, you know, but yeah, you know, nobody's generating leads, and it's because they're not using attraction marketing. You know, I said 95 percent or more. Are not online, but I think it's higher. I, I, it has to be high. I mean, like I said, 99%. But that's why, you know, I always suggest MLSP to people. You know, if, if you give them a tool and a resource on how to build their network marketing business, that's how you're going to make money from, from your notes. You know, with your network marketing company, there's actually a network marketing company. I'm not going to mention the name right now, but there's a lot of top earners that are, you know, because they've been hit with, you know, they've been hit by, uh, you know, the government and stuff like that. Top earners are, you know, they and they're making, you know, killing, you know, fifteen, twenty a month, and they're worried about what's going to go on because they had they don't have another, you know, stream of income coming in. That's their that's their main baby is that one uh, MLM. You, you know, you need to have something that's congruent with your MLM, and MLSP is, you know, very congruent because if you, this is a way that you're actually helping people build their business. You know, you're providing them a resource and a tool to help them build their business. You know, a, a product, you know, a product, you know, of, uh, you know, MLM company, it, it might help you and, you know, and serve you that day. But if you're trying to build a business, you want to help, you, you're trying to stay in the game longer. You want to help, you know, as many people as you can, you know, stay in the game longer and help them make some extra money so they can stay in the game longer instead of, you know, the high failure rate. So just a real recap of attraction marketing. Put value into the marketplace. You know, that's very simple. You know, I, I mean, you, you, if you put value into the marketplace, you will be rewarded for it. It's, it's hard not to be re rewarded when you put value into the marketplace. You know, most have full-time jobs. Um, so you have to have a way to generate leave and put prospects into your sales funnel. This is called list building. You know, you have to have people that you're talking to every single day. And, you know, if you're using attraction marketing and a resource like MLSP, you're going to be able to build your list and have people to talk to every single day. This is when... You know, prospecting becomes easier, and you also get you know paid to prospect. 
you know, because once you generate that lead, you, you're talking to them, and then you can actually make money of those people who say no to you. So you're getting paid to prospect. You know, build your business using both offline and online strategies. And, it, you know, because a lot of people, they want to go online, you know, because they don't want to do, you know, offline networking, you know. And I'm not saying there, there's people I know who's built strictly online because they don't have a, they don't have any influence offline. So I've, I've known people who build it straight offline. But I'm saying use both if you can use both, and um, to build your business, and have a way to profit from your nose. You know, it's it's just going to keep you in the game longer. Um, you know, and because if you are network marketing is not a get rich quick. It's not, uh, you know work 90 days and I'm set for life or work a year and I'm set for life. It's you work as hard as you can work your ass off for a season and then the season could be a year, it could be three years, it could be five years. And then, um, you're set for life. But while you're building it, you need something to keep you in the game longer. And that's where MLSB comes in. So did you find value in this? Yeah. Cool. Awesome. So where do we go from here? You know, become more valuable. Um, if you become more valuable, um, and if you become more valuable, you're gonna be able to educate your team, and an educated team, they're just gonna produce more for you. That's just that's how it works. And if you want ongoing training, cutting edge marketing strategies, you know you can head over to my website, simplesecretsolutions.com. You can get more information uh, on how you can get affiliated. Uh, you know, maybe work with me and uh, you know, find out more about MLSP. So that's the end of this. Um, did you have any questions? No? Awesome.